Good morning, good afternoon, good evening from wherever you're watching. My name is Didi if you're new here and I create fashion, lifestyle, travel and mental health content. Um, I feel like that's just a little bit of everything in between. So welcome back to this week's vlog. Uh, today is, when is it? Today is Tuesday. Yeah, today is Tuesday and um, it's the last day of the month. I'm feeling very, um, I was doing a little bit of like a rundown of how my month has been, how November has been and I'm really, really grateful for how things turned out and um, I feel like there was a lot of growth this month a lot of expectations some that i managed to meet others that i didn't manage to meet but we're just going to push them forward and keep on working where the line is and following the the path that is set out for me you know <coughs> So um, yesterday was um, the YouTube YouTube Black Africa Creator Wellness with Africa Creator Wellness Camp or something like that, and um, it was such an ex an exciting experience. Um, there were a lot of creators from around Africa. Um, we had like a uh, we had like a little um, activity to do, which was like creating beads. And to be honest, for me, I was out. I was out, out, out. I didn't know how to do anything. But I think um, the videos are gonna be pre the videos are recorded, so it's something that you can look into later. And I feel like that type of exercise makes you more. It's like you know adult games or other um, like things that. You, things that can help you with self-care and your mental health because sometimes it's important to like break from the norm and do something creative do something fun for yourself it, it's going to make and it's it's something that will help you you know stay active stay like you know expect stay with having expectations and that kind of thing so i feel like it was really 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 nice um so today i'm on my way i'm i'm already i'm already ready i'm not gonna be wearing any makeup i've just had some just showered just uh dressed up i'm going to my psychiatric visit and i'm um, hopefully seeing what's um how things have unfolded um i've been having a bit of like mild like tremors here and there so i need to get that looked into so yeah i'm gonna be going to the hospital today um don't think i'm gonna carry you guys with me because of safety you know and it's not gonna be like that up but we'll see we'll see maybe i'll come with you guys yeah so um, so that's the plan of the day um and then i'm gonna catch you guys later all right of the day i'm wearing this neutral uh knit and i'm wearing some black jeans to go with and the bag that i'm gonna be carrying is my trusty old banana bag i bought this bag in 2019 when i was uh shopping at miniso and it's been it's it's it served me so well you know it was my college bag i used to go with this bag almost every single day when I was in school so um but yeah that's the outfit of the day so the appointment is starting at 11 and it's and it's 10 right now so I need to leave as soon as possible so I'll catch you guys So I've just gotten to the hospital and I got here a bit late, like 15 minutes late and I feel like um, the way things are going it seems like I may not be checked in today, like I won't be able to see my doctor but the secretary is trying to like analyze and see if they'll be able to slot me in somewhere because it's fully booked. Oh my god I really, I really hope that I'm, able to, I'm going to be able to see him today because today is also like the free day that I had and this is what we had planned initially so yeah pray for me i hope it goes well i hope i'll be able to see him you know so in the meantime i'm going to go to the waiting area i have this book um robin sharma by robin sharma for the 5am club that i've been meaning to read so that's what i'm gonna be doing to kill time So finally we managed to get the slot in. I came in a bit late but it's manageable and we've been able to finish what I've done. Um, I think I'll update you guys on like the medication and everything else after but I wanted to introduce you to my psychiatrist, yes, I wanted to introduce you to him and then he, he's probably going to give you like a small nugget of wisdom so yeah. So the question is, 
if you were to give advice to someone who's struggling mentally, what would you tell them? Hi everybody, it's nice to be here. Um, I mean, that's a very loaded question. I guess I would um, just encourage you to realize that there is no health without mental health. And everything that you do on everyday basis, as you work, as you study, as you interact with each other, remember to be very, very conscious about how you take care of your mental health. Yeah. Nice, you heard it from the doctor himself, Dr. A.P. Hello, so <laughs> I'm telling you, from the last time I vlogged and now, there's a whole lot of a difference. I don't know if you can tell in my voice, but I have a flu. I have the worst flu ever. Last night, I'm telling you, I was almost crying because I was struggling so much to breathe. My nose was so blocked. I find breathing with my mouth so uncomfortable, you know. So, yeah, I have been drinking a lot of honey, lemon, and... Uh, honey lemon and ginger and it's been helping and at this point i feel like it's actually a slapping drink like it's very very nice it usually makes me feel so refreshed and like my i can feel like my nasals just opening up a bit but i'm going to continue with that and uh make sure that i pack her i apply kaluma which helps me every time whenever i have a flu but um yeah today is friday um I'm gonna tell you to be honest, it's taken me quite a while to come up with, um, to find an outfit because I've just been feeling like, oh my god, what am I going to wear? I feel like I need a whole new closet change because I, I feel like I just need a closet change. My style is always the same, like basic, minimal, minimalistic, but then at the end, but minimalistic and 90s, and 90s vintage, vintage style, I'm used, I'm used to, I'm so, I, I usually love dressing in, you know, mom jeans, t-shirts, um, maybe dresses, flowy dresses and all, so I feel like at this point in life, I need a closet change because of, like, you know, life is changing, I'm growing up, so, you know, yeah. <laughs> Um, but other than that, I'm good. I hope you guys have been great. I mean, tell me in the comment section how you've been doing, how you've been loving the um, the last episodes I did that, like the 10 habits for mentally, mentally, 10 habits to adopt for for your well-being and the 24 hour mental health challenge. So let me know if you enjoyed those videos. Um, I'm, I'd be so happy to create more of mental health. Stay tuned for that. All right. So at the moment, I just want to do my makeup. I have been thinking of what I'm going to do to my hair, but I'll probably just put a bun, a uh, head bun on today is actually my friend's birthday my friend's birthday dinner as well and i can't believe i'm gonna miss it because i had already scheduled today for this uh thing that i'm going to at park in so i haven't even told you guys what exactly is the occasion so today it's friday it's the third of december and park in by radisson have a tiny event where there'll be like christmas lighting christmas lighting i think setting up the tree or rather like yeah setting up the tree christmas lighting a small like late lunch and then i'm probably gonna create some content maybe do a reel do uh some pictures take some pictures because my feed has also been dry i've not been taking pictures i've just been in bed trying to make sure this flu goes away so um yeah so so i don't know do you want to do my makeup do you want to do makeup with me am i just like ba boom i think i'll just ba boom for you okay final look how does it look so i've just finished um doing my makeup i put a headband on my head because I feel like this hair looks nice like that. So outfit of the day is, um, I'm gonna show you guys the outfit of the day when I reach because I'm not using my tripod right now. But um, yeah, I want to just go downstairs now, finish watching Modern Family and then um, pack up and then I'll see you guys over there. So we just found out the place is at a different location, so we are going downstairs. Hopefully there won't be too many people, but so far it's so good. Hi Steph. Mm -hmm. Performing a Christmas carol right about now, but we are having snacks here with my sister. Thank you. More juice, we're getting more juice. <laughs> 
So the, mu the music is a bit loud. I don't even think you'll be able to hear me clearly. So I'm just gonna be giving you guys a B-roll of the whole experience. But so far, it's so good. Having snacks, I'm telling you, I can eat snacks for life. But I'm just saving space for my stomach. Um, but the tree over here is very, very beautiful. I want to take a picture over there and then just try and mingle. Although not everyone is mingling per se, I feel like there's a lot of like a difference of age, age gap, one. <laughs> <laughs> but um, but everything is good. And then they hear a I've forgotten to say that I'm so impressed with this bathroom. I feel like I have a thing for bathroom mirrors and um, anytime I go somewhere I always have to take a, like a selfie, a mirror selfie. And this reminds me of a movie. It's about schizophrenia. I think it was words on bathroom walls. That's a movie you need to watch, so yeah. <laughs> now let me go back.